guys just had a morning walk and before the morning walk I uh, of course weighed myself the weight is 109.6 kilos which um, you know brings me uh, 2.4 kilos below the weight limit so now I can play around with the meals in order to still be be below the 112 weight limit at 8 p.m. at night. So every time I eat a meal, right before having the second meal or the meal afterward, I'm gonna weigh myself just to see how much more I can eat to just to maintain a body weight below the 112. So right now we have the delicious breakfast. Cream of rice, just 80 grams, and 100 grams of strawberries beneath with delicious Vayu final protein on top absorbs and digests really easily and of course 10 grams of calabar chocolates with a little bit of cinnamon mixed through and this will be the first meal of the day so let's enjoy You have to, yeah, but you have to sit a little bit lower if it's possible. Excellent. session with Stefan. We've practiced a 45 second posing because if you do it for longer than that you'll be sent off the stage. So but it worked perfectly. He's happy about the shape and for now this is the post workout meal. This will be the last one of the day in terms of the carbs. After this we're just gonna keep loading the body with food but not with the carbs but with protein a little bit of vegetables uh, to keep the weight below the weight limit until tonight where we're gonna weigh in see how much uh, you know how the other athletes are doing and uh, yeah tomorrow the loading will begin so even after the weigh-in I think we're just gonna have the last minute of the day as usual like the uh, egg whites and the salmon but after that we wake up and the loading can begin which is what I'm looking forward to and this post rocket meal of course is cream of rice with strawberries and the Vio Final Protein as always. And make sure to check the link down below for all ESN products because they are now 20% off. It's Olympia Week, code Wesley. Thank you very much for the incredible support, guys. I really, really appreciate it. We are walking towards the weigh-in. We still have about an hour, but it's nice to be on time. It's gonna be very busy. So I just want to see what's up and we're going to see how long it takes. I already had my uh, last meal before the weigh-in. I didn't take any meals with me, just a protein shake. 
and a lot of water because I didn't really drink a lot of water either just to make sure I make weight but afterwards I'm gonna drink a lot of water go home and uh, yeah enjoy the rest of this process complete 244 pounds so that's uh, way under the weight limit and it was very very close to 63 they joked about me being 61 so uh, but hey we made it through and now it's time to uh, load up It's a nice track suit we got at the weigh-ins. So every single year you get like a hoodie. So this is my fourth Olympia hoodie. And I have to say the design is really nice. This is uh, yeah, looking pretty good. So obviously we're uh, going to be wearing this quite a lot. But for now it's time for the meal. Okay, it's time to go straight back to the shredded lettuce meals. So we have some tuna steaks on here because the amount of protein I ate today was actually a bit lower than usual because we only have three meals before going to the show. So we're uh, doubling up on protein a little bit right now. Only thing in here is some vegetables below that cucumber, lettuce, zucchini, a little bit of carrot, a little bit of bell pepper. Health remains important. Of course, a bit of salt in there. And as you can see, some zero tomato ketchup. And this is going to be uh, the semi last meal and then the last meal will simply be the egg whites and the salmon you've seen before with some asparagus and then tomorrow the loading will begin but for now let's load up on vegetables and protein all right it's time for the final meal of the day we have two pans here and it's going to be an egg white meal and a salmon meal combined with some vegetables so let's get going okay Turn on a little bit. Kaboom. So the first thing I'm going to do, add the vegetables. This is asparagus. Just putting it on the bottom of the pan. Kaboom, as you can see right there. It looks like a lot, but it's already cooked, already steamed. It nicely covers the bottom and we're going to add to these egg whites since I have done two times 350 mils there are still 200 mils in here so that's what we're gonna put on here first just like that throw this away and then we of course have another one. This is what I'm going to do. Weigh it off here. Always shake a little bit. And I honestly think it's a waste if you use whole eggs and then split the egg yolk from the egg white. So I just always buy uh, egg white packages. And a little bit more. About 150. Just like that. And here, we have the salmon, so I'm going to choose two salmon fillets. This is about 200 grams in total then, so let's just cut one of them off. Let's end this day with some healthy fats, guys, and salmon has just that. But we are going to um, put the salmon in at the last moment, because this is already cooked, 
I sous vide cook this. I did that back at home. We have a steaming oven with a sous vide function, which means that you vacuum seal your protein, you cook it on a very low temperature, and then it cooks perfectly. But if you want to get the skin crispy, you gotta put it in a pan. So first, I'm gonna put this a little higher. Yes, put the lid on it. And in the meantime, we are gonna take our sleep supplements. I'll put this in the fridge first. Time for the sleep stack, guys. Ashwagandha, GABA. We also have some magnesium in here, which is what I like to take. And most importantly, also some sleep. Oh, this is D3 and K2. <laughs> but this is a sleep spray melatonin, so let's use that first. Mm. to ensure a good night's sleep and uh, the big benefit is you don't have to take a container with you like this uh, just like with this one you have a container usually of these vitamins but if it's a spray it's way more convenient to take on travel and it's delicious as well and that's enough of those and then I can take three of these GABA as I've mentioned in a previous video Neurotransmitter relaxes the brain. And this is also very, very nice, has been proven to reduce anxiety. So if you have trouble falling asleep, not physically, but mentally thinking about stuff that you have to do the next day, this actually does help for that. So to re relax the mind. And magnesium relaxes both the mind and the body. So what I like to do is always combine magnesium bisglycinate, which passes the blood-brain barrier, and magnesium oxide to be able to go to the bathroom the next day. It actually has a, a slight laxative effect. Not too much, it sounds bad, but laxative literally means that it makes it easier to eliminate the waste from your body. And that's it for the for the sleep stack basically and every time I take this it really helps me to sleep especially a few months ago when Laura was much younger she kept us up all night by then taking this the hours you do get to sleep are more qualitative so to me that is very important and in the meantime the egg whites are cooking and once it is almost done cooking I'm gonna put the salmon in and show you just that Don't forget the salt, obviously. So a lot of people are afraid of using salt. And um, you really shouldn't be. Because only when you want to lose water weight at the last very day, and you drop the water, you keep the salt in, you're obviously going to keep holding on to the water. So, but if you want to actually have a healthily performing body and you're not eating carbs like I am right now, you actually need the minerals because you hold on to the minerals way more difficult if you don't consume carbs. And if you carb up, you need sodium to be able to transfer the carbs into your body. So you actually need to take sodium and keep it high all the way until the last day. In my opinion, if you then Look at yourself, you're spilling over a little bit of water weight. You drop the water and drop the salt. Maybe keep the water up a little bit, but at least drop the salt to be able to drop a little bit more water. But that will be the only place that you would need to drop salt at all. And when I think salt, it's one of the best things you can have as a body water, in my opinion.
Okay, final zero carb meal before the load commences tomorrow. Very much looking forward to it. But this for now is more of a recovery and muscle retention and just keeping the uh, structure intact. So we have here 10 egg whites, some asparagus, two salmon fillets, so only protein and healthy fats with a bit of salt. And that's gonna be it for today. And then we're gonna go to sleep. That nice sleep stack really does help. And by the way, check the link down below because right now a lot of supplements are 20% off with code Wesley. Anyway, guys, I really want to thank you a whole lot for watching. Thank you a lot for the incredible support you've been giving me throughout you know, the last couple of months, really, but especially the last couple of weeks leading up to the Olympia. It really does mean a lot. And also, I've talked to a lot of you guys today. Uh, and I'll talk to a lot of you guys tomorrow as well at the uh, Athletes Meet and Greet. So make sure to be there if you are here. And yes, as always, don't forget to stay golden.